You are watching Fugitive Red Eye, and welcome to another weekly scam baiting video. This week I decided to give the scammers a taste of my best Alex Jones impression I could do. And while it's not great, I think it was pretty entertaining to do. As per the usual, anything I say that comes across as offensive doesn't necessarily represent my views, but is mainly done for entertainment purposes and to piss off the scammer. Enjoy the rest of the video. Hi Sam, I think my computer's been hacked by the globalists. I said, I think my computer's been hacked by the globalists. So your computer has been hacked by the globalists? Yes, the globalists have hacked my computer. And how do you know that? Well, it's obvious. They must have figured out who I was and tracked me down to stop me from spreading, spreading the truth. So what do you want to do now? I need help getting my computer unhacked, and I got this number online. Well, in order to unhack your computer, it will cost you. How much will it cost me? Six hundred bucks. How much? It's $600. 600 Can't you give me a discount because I'm a internet personality? Uh, you're a what? Because I'm a well-known news reporter for- So, there will be a discount of $100. $500 will be the last offer. You can't do me any better. I bet you're working with the globalists in their secret underground network to make a freaking frogs gay! Do you want your computer to get fixed or not? Yes, I do. So, it will cost you $500. All right, well, I suppose I'll have to deal with that. Uh, how do we do this? So, just help me with the card number. Card number? But you're not even helping me with the computer yet. Shouldn't you service it first? Well, we just need to get the Microsoft anti-hacking tool installed on your computer. All right, how do we do that? And before that, you need to register your computer to the Microsoft server. So, just help me with the card number, and we will register your computer, and we can install the anti-hacking. Um, well, can't you connect to my computer first and we can install it that way? I'm not comfortable giving my phone number over the, or my, my card number over the phone, because the globalists are listening in on this. I'm sure that they have my phone line tapped, and they're, uh, monitoring it for their extra-dimensional masters. Alright, if we want your computer to get connected, uh, that's okay. Let's do it your way then, okay? Okay, how do we do that? I'll, uh, uh, are in front of your computer right now? Yes, I am. Uh, right. Uh, have a look on the keyboard at the left bottom corner. You see a Windows 4 flat key? Uh, I've actually replaced all my keys with customized keys, so it doesn't have that one anymore. So which key is that? Uh, it actually has the Illuminati symbol on it now. Oh, so you're a member of Illuminati. Oh, hell no! No, I'm gonna take them down! So just do one thing, open up the browser. Okay, which browser do you want me to use? Anyone, Google Chrome, Internet Explorer. Okay, well, I don't have any of those. I only have the Onion Router, so I'll use that. Uh, which one you have? The Onion Router, Tor. Sorry, what? Tor. T O R, the Onion Router. Well, I'm not familiar with that one. What that is? It's a browser that allows me to access the deep web so that I can find the true secrets of the globalists and expose their interdimensional time traveling conspiracy. Okay, so you're accessing the deep web, right? Exactly. You can be in a deep trouble someday. So I can be in a what now? can be in a deep trouble in some day, you know what that? Why, why would you say that? What kind of trouble could I possibly be in? Because deep web is like used by the international gangsters and all the, uh, like, uh, uh, like the ministers and, and, and the rich people, you know that? It's yes, I am aware that the globalists the also use the deep web, but I myself use it to fight the globalists. <laughs> Well, you need my help to fight the globalists, right? Yes, I need your help to fight the globalists. Would you like to join our cause? Well, that, that's one of a hell cause. Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's take down the globalists. What I want you to do is I want you to get me an octopus and a snail and meet me by the train station in Tokyo, Japan. I'll explain later. <laughs> All right. All right, but for the time being, let's focus on the computer. I'm sorry, what? I said, for the time being, let's focus on the computer. I need this computer to help me defeat the globalists. I'm not able to understand it. I said, let us focus on the computer. So, how, how you are going to meet me? Like, what do you need for that? Do you need my card number or something like that? Well, I mean, uh, we can get to that. We can get to that. I mean, there are restitution fees, of course. Uh, but first, what we want to do is we want to uh, get connected to the computer so that I can recruit you into the, uh into the Anti-Globalist League. So do you got any website or something like that? 
Uh, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> www.http colon slash slash 156-387-94-23168-11333-789-70102 dot onion. Just for the information, www comes after http, it doesn't come before http, you should know that. Oh, I'm aware of that, but mine is a deep website, so they can be arranged in any random order. No, it cannot, it cannot go that way. Yes, it can. Obviously, you've never used the deep web. No, I don't have the access of the deep web. I never used it, you know? Right. you gotta, you got to have that Torg or something browser to, or the VPN or something to get inside the deep web. Yes, you do need Tor, and it is recommended you have an IP jumper as well, but that's regardless. So, can you give me the access of the deep web? Uh, I can't, but you can certainly find it yourself. Um, I myself just want to recruit you into the Republic of Kekistan. So how 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 I'm gonna search? Like what I'm gonna search to access the deep web? What's that? I'm sorry. What I'm gonna search to get access of deep web? Like what do I know, need to get inside the deep web? Uh, well, what you'll want to do is get on your computer, go to www.pornhub.com. Yeah. That's not a deep web. That's easily available. There's a secret link on my Pornhub channel to the deep web. There's a secret channel that goes to the deep web. Yes. You just want to search and for two girls, that? one cup. Trust me. I'm sorry, what? Search search on Pornhub for two girls, one cup. Trust me. It will help you find it. All right. I'll do that right away, okay? Excellent. I look forward to having you involved in the glorious Republic of Kekistan. All right, surely I will I'll make my uh, colleagues to join this cause, okay? Well, I have around 50 guys who can join this cause, okay? Great, all right. You can have a great force from Pakistan as well. No, no, no. Kekistan, Kekistan is what we're, we're striving to achieve, international Kekistanism. Kekistan? Kekistan, not Kukistan. Kukistan's another enemy. Kekistan, K E K. Praise Kek. Hey, long live to Kekistan. Yeah, say praise Kek for me, would you? Kekistan, long live to Kekistan. All right, that's good enough. I appreciate your contribution, and I will see you next time. Kiss, kiss. Thank you for calling support. How can I help you? Yes, I think my computer's been hacked by the Illuminati. <laughs> Hey, I think my computer might have a virus. You have a credit card? I do, yeah. Can you fold that and put it in your ass? I, I could try to fold it, I suppose, but uh, getting it in my ass, is there any particular reason? You have a white ass or a black ass? Well, it's it's white currently, but if I took a shit, it'd be nice and brown. <laughs> yes, I'm having some issues with my computer, sir. Yeah, it's running really slow, and it's giving me this pop-up telling me that I got a virus. Well, it's a, it's a pretty scary message, and it, it tells me that my computer is uh, compromised. Oh, goodness. Can I have your first and last name, sir? Yes, the name is Alex Jones. And can I have your last contact number in case the call gets disconnected, I can call you back? Oh, uh, yeah, that's uh, 1-800-STEAMER. It's 1-800-what? Steamer, S-T-E-E-M-E-R. At Stanley Steamer. Oh, See, I run a business. What's the phone? That's my business What's number. Phone number sir? That is my phone number. 1 800 Steamer. I run a steaming business. I want a 10 digit phone number. Okay, fine. 1619 235 456 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 50, 60. That is great. That's a hell of a lot of beautiful number you got there, sir. I know it is. And where do you got this number from? NASA? From where? NASA? Yeah, I got it from NASA. So you work for NASA? I certainly do there, sir. Oh, great. It is a pleasure talking with somebody who works for NASA. Yes, sir, I'm an astronaut. And how did NASA's computer go to water? That's a good question. That's what I'm trying to figure out, and that's what I'm hoping you can help me with. Well, I certainly do understand NASA got their own technicians who are better than Microsoft. When it comes to yeah, but you're not Microsoft, are you? No, we're not Microsoft. See? So why don't you help me? Well, I'm not Microsoft, and I'm not from NASA, so there is no possibility I can fix an issue like
like this, which a Microsoft technician or a NASA technician couldn't fit. Well, tell me this. Can you do me this? Can you make me a uh, chicken vindaloo? No, I can make you a funny chicken if you want. A what now? It's a chicken. It's a special chicken. Oh, curry chicken? Yes, it's called as a funny chicken. Not sure of that one. I, I prefer vindaloo myself. You want chicken or you want computer to get fixed? Well, if you can fix my computer using curry, that'd be great. Oh, 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 and oh. Now I judge. You're the same person that was calling before and was from the dark web something, and you were fighting for a greater cause. Yeah, that's right. You still down to help yeah. me, brother? We need to get rid of these globalists that are putting chemicals in the water to make the freaking frogs gay. I can hear you if you can speak a bit slow. I don't know whether anybody is running behind you or running after you or maybe there is a train that you had to catch. That's why you are going too fast. I don't know what's wrong with you. <laughs> I don't even know what you mean by that, dude. Just calm down and speak slowly so that we can have a man-to-man -man conversation. Okay. Uh, what do you want to all talk right, about? So, got a, got any topics? So, first of all, how do you got our number? That I'm not going to tell you. All right, so what you are going to do when you got my number? You're going to keep calling us? That's kind of the idea, yeah. yeah. All right, so how does it feel calling us and wasting your time? What's that? So how does it feel calling us again and again and wasting your time? Oh, it's fine. I love it. Okay, so you don't have any work to do, I guess. Not for another half hour. Is somebody, is somebody after you? Yeah, the globalists are after me. So the globalists are after you because you are a news reporter after all, right? Absolutely. I report for the true news, not the mainstream media. They're a bunch of inconsistent fake news. That's, that's you, you, you know, you have a lot of knowledge about this dark web and what's going on with the world. Like actual real world what's going on and who is behind this. I absolutely do. So, why are you wasting your time by calling us? You should be doing something about that. Well, I felt that I needed to get this computer dehacked by the globalists so that their interdimensional network can't interfere with oh, my uh, pretty, vaporwaves. Pretty hell of a lie because, because most of the people in the America, they don't know about this. They're like sheep, what they have been told to do. That's right, we need to wake up the sheeple. All right, so you already have woke up and you know each and everything by now. So you know about the Illuminati, you know about this uh, dark web, you know about what's going on with the world and who is running the world, actually. So right. you should be doing something instead of calling us. No, no, this is much more entertaining. You know what we are doing over here? Scamming people, as a matter of fact. Absolutely correct. So when we got a job to do, you should also get a job to do. I have a job to do. I told you, I report the real news. Oh, you don't work for any shit, man. Yes, I do. You know, what is, you know what's going on? What's I going on? You, I make money. Oh, do you? Just, yeah, I'm making money, and you're just wasting your time and brain. Oh? I'm not getting paid for scamming people. I'm getting paid for talking. No, you're not. You're getting paid for scamming people. We both know that. I don't know. I don't need the card information or anything like that from you, buddy. I just need to have a great conversation with you. And I am paid around $2 per five minutes. So we already have been, I earned my money. So you just wasted your seven minutes of your life. I don't think that's true at all. It doesn't matter what you think. Well, it doesn't matter what lies you try to tell me either. It doesn't matter. I'm just making a point over here. No, you're not making any point. You're trying to convince me not to call you, but I'm, I'm not, not going to stop. You to blame me. I am not forcing you to blame me. I'm not going to stop calling you, dude. I don't care. Don't stop. I'm not asking you to stop calling me. Don't stop. You want to waste your time? You can go ahead. We have a lot of time. This isn't a waste of my time. It's a waste of yours. Well, you're wasting your time, not mine. I have plenty of time. I make plenty of money. Well, so do I. My one hour, you waste my one hour. It doesn't matter for me. Because I already have made about 10,000 bucks tonight. So you're, you're just trying to fucking money. make yourself sound cool. You don't make anywhere near that amount of money, I'm sure. I'm sure the big guys like your old buddy Shagar Takar keep more of it. Only few people, like, you don't know what exactly.
You just make shit up. I've heard interviews from other scammers. Don't don't even. I wish. I wish you could have understood that. You should you should have well, you should have heard about the IRS scammers, right? Yeah, I know about them. So how much they make per call? I'm not talking about per day, per call. They were making seven to eight thousand. No, they're not. Don't even. That's bullshit, and you know it. Oh, come the on. big guys at the top might make that per actual victim. But these little guys who are on the phone like yourself, you little munchkin scammers, you don't make shit. Well, that's your opinion, and it doesn't matter. It's true, though. I believe you're a jealous way. We are making money, or are just sitting over there scratching your ass and not getting anything from it. It's we who are getting money out of you. You're not getting any money for this, though, are you? Oh, I don't care. I already have made my money. I don't care. Waste my one hour. I don't care. Waste my two hours. I don't care. I already have my money. Oh, really? But you could always have more, right? That's what we work for. That's what everybody works for. It's money. It's money game, buddy. Well, you know, one day that's going to catch up to you. Nobody can catch Maybe not today, it's maybe not, not tomorrow, but it will happen. Everybody, everybody is mixed up, you know? Everybody. Do you still think if the government wants, they cannot catch the scammers? They can, but they're mixed up. That's because the Indian government is corrupt. What? It's corrupt. Everybody's government is corrupt. Do you think your government Well, of course every government is corrupt. That's in the nature of governments. So, your government corrupt, our government corrupt. So that's how it works. They make their money, we make our money. Everybody is making money. Yeah, I get that. But I honestly think scammers are the criminals I respect the least. Because at least there's some criminals that have codes of honor. You know what scammers do? Scammers call people and tell them you have a virus inside your computer, but we are not calling anybody. People call us. Yeah, but that's because you put out these fake messages that scare them. Well, that's not that's not how it works, okay? When you call me and you tell me I have a problem, I gotta fix it, we fix it, take the money. You're not really gonna fix it, you're gonna put on some fake antivirus. Well, we're gonna take out the virus, so that's how it works. There's no real virus to take out, though, so you're just charging people for nothing. So that's it. I mean, like, it's always fair in sales. That's how sales work. It's not sales, it's and theft. You, you cannot make sales on a truth. Okay, you had to mix up lies to get a sale. That's not entirely true. There are plenty of things that can be sold that's honestly. That's there are a lot of shady salesmen out there, I'll give you that. But that doesn't give you an excuse to fucking do what you do. Well, this is not like an ordinary sale. You sell our uh, jeans to a customer and you add up something that makes that jeans costly. No, this is an internet sale. Okay? You can tell anything you want. This is a cyber world, my friend. You are so delusional, dude. It uh, doesn't matter. You've just been indoctrinated into this shit. You've convinced care. yourself with this double I, thing I to think care. that you're the, you're you the good person. Care. You tell, you want to say something, say it. I don't care. Okay? Because I know how to make money. That's no excuse, that doesn't make what you're doing right. You know the British, what they did in India for for around 190 years, they looted. And right now the US government is looting Afghanistan, Iraq, looting all that you are doing. What are you doing? I'm wasting your time in them, obviously. I'm here calling you. In, in somebody's home, you had to do When I got an American in my home, I had to do something about it. I'm not from India. Fuck India. Subscribe to Fiji to Red Eye.